Hey guys, Churchy here. So in this short video, I want to show you how to farm for the uh, Black Flame Monk armor set. Um, I love the look of this set, especially the gauntlets and the greaves. The hood's really cool too. I'm not entirely sold on the chest piece slash robes. I think it's mostly the breastplate that sort of puts me off a little, but um, overall it's an awesome looking armor set. Uh, so I'll show you how to get to the spot where you're going to be farming and um, then I'll show you how to farm for it basically. Let's get straight into it. So here I am at the side of Grace in the Divine Tower of Kaelid basement. It's uh, this side of Grace here. And this is basically the farming spot for this set. Um, so you come down these stairs and you'll fight this guy here. But before we do that, I'm just going to sort of show you how to get here. So let's get to that now. Alrighty, so here we are at the uh, first step Lost Grace checkpoint in uh, Limgrave. And basically what we're going to be doing, um, I will divide this into chapters so you can skip what you don't need, but what we're going to be doing is pretty much traveling from Limgrave up to Kaelid, and then we're going to basically make our way to the Divine Tower of Kaelid Basement. So what we're going to do is uh, going to start here, basically just head up through the woods, make our way across there, down this path, across that bridge, head down this dirt road. We're going to come down here. And we're going to head up this sort of cliff face, jump our way up there. Then we're going to come up here and we'll be able to jump over this barrier and get into Kaelid. Then we'll get this waypoint, scale along this cliff edge here, and then make our way across here past that checkpoint. And then we'll jump across the gap here, pick up that Lost Grace, and then continue on to the Divine Tower, climb our way up the tower, get that checkpoint, and then make our way down the inside of the tower until we finally come to the Divine Tower of Kaelid Basement Lost Grace and then that will be the spot where we'll be farming for the uh, Black Flame armor set. Alrighty, so let's get on our horse and start making our way to Kaelid. And as I said, I'll have check, I'll have chapters in the, uh, in the video so that you can skip the parts you don't need. So if you already have made your way to Kaelid, then you can go from there. Make our way through the forest, fear right towards the east. This is just a nice, easy way to get through Limgrave to Kaelid. So now we'll follow this road along and you can see now on the map we're here so we're going to follow to that bridge and then after we get across that bridge we want to turn left down the dirt road so now that we're at this this point in our journey we want to turn left and come along this dirt path and you want to curve to the right here and keep going down and just keep making our way down once again you can pretty much ignore the enemies there are definitely uh, a few other ways to get to uh, Kaelid, but uh, this is just a nice, simple, easy road to take. But yeah, so now you can see we're here. This is where we want to kind of start heading north and come up this bit. You can also head down to the church and get that Lost Grace if you need to. But yeah, you can avoid this giant and that because basically we just want to head straight across here. And then just avoid these wolves. Jump up here. Jump into the, another air thing. And now, just like that, we're up the top of the cliffs and you can already see the church landmark. And you can see where we're kind of heading. You can see the terrain changing. So head up past the church and these swords and then make your way up to this barrier. And then you can jump over the barrier. And this Lost Grace is a good one to get just so if something goes wrong, it's always good to check to grab these checkpoints along the way if you haven't got them. So now what we're gonna do is, yeah, like I said, make our way along there, cut straight across here, head down that way, and then up to the, uh, up to the tower here. So let's do that. Make our way along this cliff face. Now be careful here, because there are big nasty dog enemies. And then if you want, you can get this Lost Grace always handy to do and you can see straight ahead of us is where we want to uh, cross come up to this little bit here and then we can jump across here and once again there's another another checkpoint we can pick up if we want to alrighty we have made it to the uh, divine tower All right, so here we are at the Divine Tower of Kaelid, and there's actually a couple of different ways that you can scale this tower. Um, I'm just gonna show you like the safest way basically, where you only have to go past one enemy, and it's just a pretty easy path. So you just run along this lower log, 
And you can just run along here, jump off there. Fight this one guy. Try not to fall off the edge. <laughs> Alright, so kill him. And then climb up this ladder. And basically we'll be making our way left along this bit. But yeah, we can climb up this second ladder. And now what you want to do is get onto this little bit here. Hop back on torrent. And now it's time for a little bit of styling. So you jump out and jump again. And now you've made it. And you can drop down here. And then hop off again if you want. Doesn't matter, you can do this with or without torrent. And then you want to just come along here, jump across that layer. Don't need to jump, it's fully sealed this one. There's a few that have gaps, so just be careful of that if you do go another way. And we just head up here. Ah, uh, there you go, you can see a gap over on the right there. Grab a nice little uh, rune there. Come running across here, running down here and jump that gap and then climb up this ladder and you can see this ladder is actually taking us right to a gap in the side of the tower which is where we can get inside and then get another Lost Grace checkpoint. So we'll head in here and we've made it inside the tower. Hooray! All right, so we made it inside the Tower of Caled, and now we want to head down this path here. Head down these stairs. There's a couple of enemies. Um, I'm gonna do this bit kind of quickly. I'm just gonna run past them. Um, there is also a door, but that door's usually closed, but you can open it later. But basically you want to jump down here. Just ignore those enemies if you can. Head along this bit. And then when we come to here, you want to try and basically land this is going to break but you want to land and then head instantly that way so that you can land on this part here and then we can fight this guy i'm just sort of trying to do this a bit quick he's not actually too bad to stance break but this is one of the guys the uh the black flame monks which is how you get this set so yeah, you can kill him. And then what you can actually do is just to be sort of careful is um, this ladder here. We will be proceeding that way. So what I might do is I'll trigger the lift to come up here and I'm going to head up this ladder. This is basically so if you muck it up, you won't have to do that jump again. You can just come straight down this ladder. But basically when you come up this ladder, you're on the other side of that door which you'll see in a minute. Do, 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 do. All right, so here we are, and there's that entrance where those enemies were before. So that's where I came down before and jumped down there. Um, and this is where you come to open that door. So then if you've died, you can just run past again and not have to worry about jumping down and stuff. So slide back down this ladder. And now the elevator's waiting for us. Now we just kill this enemy. And then scale our way along this wall. And just keep coming around. And then you will reach this bit where you can see another elevator that's leading all the way to the bottom there. And you can see this spool. So what you want to do, you want to line yourself up with this. And then you want to aim it so that if I'm facing this way, basically we'll be falling to the left. But if I'm looking this way, you want to fall uh, on the right side of the screen. So basically we're going to use that little, uh, little round coil there to bounce off and then land on that platform on the right there. So basically you jump off like this, you just walk off, you don't need to jump, you just do that and then you'll hit that, bounce off and land on here. And then you just hit this to activate 
the uh, elevator and that will come right right up here for us and then we just hop in the elevator and make our way down to the bottom and you can see the lost grace down there already and there we go we've made it to the basement we can get this side of grace and uh, now you're ready to do the farming. So basically there's an enemy that is just down here, one of the uh, Black Flame Monks. So this is the guy we want to fight. And yeah, so then basically you just keep, you keep killing him. Uh, you come back up, rest at the Lost, uh, lost Grace. And then, uh, yeah, and then just rinse and repeat and just keep doing that. And then, yeah, eventually you can get the full set. So that, that guy can drop this full set that I'm wearing now, which is the, uh, the hood, the armor, the gloves and the boots. So Black Flame Monk hood, Black Flame Monk armor, Black Flame Monk gauntlets and Black Flame Monk greaves. So another cool thing here is there's actually a boss in here, which is the Godskin Apostle. Um, which I had a fun time fighting, um, but basically if you kill him, you can get a cool set of armor too and a nice great sword down in the great swords down in that chest that you can see that I've opened. I will quickly show you that set as well. So this is the set you can get off the boss. Also a cool set. So back up to the checkpoint again, have a little snoozy, hop back up, come back down the stairs and uh, fight him again. And what's he dropped this time? There we go, we got the Black Flame Monk Greaves. So that is the process. Basically, you just keep coming down and fighting this uh, this guy and going back up and resting at the Lost Grace. And uh, eventually you'll be able to get this whole set. So yeah, that's how you farm for the Black Flame Monk set. Um, I really, really like the look of this set, particularly the gauntlets and the greaves. Um, the hood's really nice too. I'm not 100% sold on the uh, chest armor slash robe. Um, it's mainly the breastplate. Uh, but yeah, I will take that off for a second just to show you the full look of the greaves. Um, really, really love the greaves and the gauntlets. But yeah, that's how you get this set. I hope this video has been useful for you guys and hopefully shown you a thing or two. Uh, thank you for watching and thank you to the legends supporting me on Patreon. I could not be doing this stuff without you guys and I really, really appreciate the support. But that's it for this video. So have a good day or night, whichever it may be. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.